Hi, if you happen to make videos or audios, then you might find transcription very important. This allows people who might not understand your language or even follow whatever you are saying to have a text version which they can read from or even translate to their respective languages. While this is an important part of the video and audio making process, it takes a lot of time to have accomplished. What if I tell you there's a simple way to actually get this done? Yes, there is. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to easily get this done using a very simple process. Without talking further, let's get right into the video. So to get started with this process, you simply open your browser and then um, enter docs.google.com in your um, search bar. And then this is going to open Google Docs for you. So I'll go ahead and then hit on um, blank document. So this is going to create an entire blank document. Now what we are basically going to do is we are going to use the voice typing feature in Google Docs to be able to detect whatever voice that is um, audio sound being played. And then it's going to basically transcribe that. So that's a very simple process. Now, as part of that, um, there's the possibility you might not get 100% of whatever you're saying. You can actually come back and edit that, but um, there's also one feature you might have to implement to be able to detect whatever you're saying properly. So I'll show you that. Um, in the Google Docs, you simply come to Tools and then you come to Voice Type, and which is here. So what I'm going to do is I'm either going to talk or I'm going to use Play a Video, which I already have, to um, detect that. So let me. Um, click on this microphone over here so as i begin to speak you realize it's begin to you know capture whatever i i am actually saying now you realize that this isn't capturing it in a very perfect way the reason is because i am using a Ghanaian asset so i need to change that so on this particular microphone icon you realize there's english us over here so when you click on the drop down here you get a chance of selecting english but this time around, um, a Ghanaian English. So let me just um, select this here. So this is English, Ghana. Now I'm using a Ghanaian accent. So once I begin to speak, you realize that it's actually detecting it perfectly as previously. So let me go ahead and then play this video that I have on my phone and then let's see what happens. So let me increase the volume. I'm going to show you how to control how people use your data on your network. Now for the purpose of this video, I'm going to demonstrate this using the MTN template. Without talking further, let's get right into it. To get started, you have to be connected to the network. Then you so your as you can see, one. it was actually taking whatever my video or the audio which was being played and it was just typing that out. Now this is a very cool feature which allows you to have your videos or audios easily transcribed because um, like I was saying earlier, it's very difficult to come back, listen to whatever you're saying and then type everything out. What if you have a very simple tool which just listen to whatever you're playing and then it's able to transcribe that for you. Now this feature is also available in uh, Microsoft Word but the sad part of this is that is only limited to um, English, US, UK so you don't have a Ghanaian version. So that wouldn't give you a perfect um, you know, um, output as compared to that of the Google Docs. So, let me just start talking so uh, you realize it's actually taking that in but it's not so much perfect as compared to that of the Google Doc. So there you have it. I actually wish I knew how to do this long time ago. It would have saved me a lot of time having a lot of videos and audios transcribed but it's all good. So that is the end of this video. In case you are new, kindly smash the subscribe button and then don't forget to hit on the bell so that anytime there's a new video, you get to see it. Once again, my name is Eshmalamte. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.